Hello. So, I go to Benidorm tomorrow. It is currently quarter to six on Wednesday night and I haven't done anything. Well, I'll tell a lie, right? I have a to-do list on my phone of things I had to do today to prep and I look at the nails. They need fixed before I go on Benidorm. The skin is pale. I need to tan because I will not get a natural tan in four days in Benidorm. And I've just had a nap. Like, that's when my face is still a bit red. So, I had to go to the post office to pick my euros up. I've done that. Um, had to phone 02. Done that. Booked the travel insurance. Done that. Very last minute. I needed to fill in a Spanish health form, which I've done that as well. And I've shivered, shaved and exfoliated my full body. So, I've got a few more things I need to do. I need to take my toenail polish off, but I'm gutted last night, basically half in my big toe toenail ripped off. But I need to take my toenail polish off, put my clothes away, mm, do I put those away? If I've got time, I've got washing hanging up there that I need to put away, um, yeah, before I go. I need to take my gel polish off, well, what's left yet on my fingers, do my gels, I need to wash my makeup brushes and beauty blenders because mine's are minging. Tint my eyebrows, tight curl hair, I need to pack my case, weigh my case, and I need to fake tan or fake tan moisturise. So I've got a lot to do. So this video is going to be a pack and prep with me for Benidorm. I've no longer done one of these, well, a few months ago I've done one of these for going to London. So basically the same style because in London I'm pretty sure I left everything to the last minute and I'm leaving everything to the last minute yet again. And I got my hair cut last week, so I can finally wear my hair in a crocodile clip, even though it looks a bit mental. I'm a little lad. Anyway, I'm going to start doing my nails because my nails are bugging me. This nail snapped last night, so I had to file that down. So I'm going to have to cut and file all my nails down. And again, they were at a nice length. They were at a nice length. So I'm going to do my nails first because they'll take me the longest, I think. So let's see the nails I want to try and do. I don't have nail art tools, but I still want to try and do these nails. So just a neutral nail with the evil eye on each finger. So I'm going to try that. I'm just going to put a YouTube video on and then put you on a time lapse because I have done my nails on camera a lot now. So I'm going to take my gels off, put new gel polish on. And then I will come back. Yeah. My hands are so shaky.
loving the way these turned out. Oh my god, I'm so excited! Oh, the stress of doing all that with a nail tool. And again, I know, I'm sorry, you can't see me. It's not very personal. But doing all that without any nail tools, using cotton buds, the end of a makeup stick, and a pair of tweezers, I'm pretty proud of myself. This is a hand that's going to stress me the fuck out, though. And time update, it's 20 past 7. My right hand didn't take as long as I thought it would. I thought I was going to have breakdowns. I've done less mistakes on this hand than this hand. Anyway, let's go back to my list, see what else we need done. I think right now, I'm going to curl my hair because that's another big task. It does take quite a while. I've got to put some dry shampoo in my hair because I haven't washed it from last Saturday when I got it cut. And I don't have time to like wash it before we go. And then I'm thinking, I'm going to be in the chlorine. Just got to get my in. Anyway, so what's the point? So, a bit of dry shampoo and we'll be fine. Okay, the hair is now curled. Hopefully it falls out nicely for tomorrow. It is five past nine. Still got a lot to do. Last thing I'm going to do before I start packing, I still need to do my toenails, I still need to do my tan. Don't think I'm going to wash my makeup brushes. I mean, it's fine. And I've got clean beauty blenders anyway. I've got plenty of beauty blenders. So, before I start packing, I'm going to tint my eyebrows. I probably need to pluck a few as well. So to tint my eyebrows I use the Maybelline New York Tattoo Brow Easy Peel Off Tint and this is in the shade Medium Brown. So it goes on quite strange. So you just put it on like so. So I fire quite a lot on to begin with. Then I take a little angled brush and just make sure all the brows covered. Okay, that's how I tint my eyebrows. Leave them to sit for like 15 minutes, then peel it off. Okay, oh, that burn. You see that? When I burnt my fucking thumb. Ah. Right. I really wish this eyebrow was more full. Anyway, eyebrows done ish. I might put another layer on just at the front. I'm going to do a wee haul while I'm showing you this because I was going to do a sit down Shein haul but it just went to shit. So I picked up a few things for Primark. I only had one pair of jammies to go and I thought I need two. So I just picked up we rubbed set for Primark. So it's the white top and then the little lemon yellow bottoms. Right for Shein I picked up three bikinis because Shein's swimwear is absolutely unreal. Neon orange triangle top with the high-waisted bottoms as well and these bottoms kind of ruche at the side there's a wee tie and you pull and they ruche up at the side and since I've been into my more neutrals I got this colour block one again the triangle top and high-waisted bottoms as well 
There is a belt loop on these bottoms, but I don't know who's wearing a belt with a bikini, but right. Then this one. This is more just a bralette style top, lilac, and it's like waffle material. Uh, not sure if it's actually waterproof, but I'm sure time will tell when I go in the pool with it. And that's just the bottoms for them there. Oh, my back's breaking already sitting on this floor. Right, then I got these pyjamas for Shein. Here's the bottoms. They're silk with just a nice pattern on them. Really light and airy. And the top, oh my god. Not really doing well at showing you. But it's got a nice pattern on it. And hopefully I don't stick to them because they're silk. And silk and heat doesn't go. All my day outfits are shirt and shorts. Just because sets are so much easier. You don't need to plan an outfit. So the first set is a brown and white check. So here's the shorts and the wee shirt to go with it. You'll see all these outfits a lot better in my vlog. Okay. Next set, I actually wanted the blue and yellow floral print but I ran out of my size so I settled for the green. Green and floral, it's like a dad shirt kind of style but I'm into that. And here's the shirt to go with it as well. Very dad vibes. So I picked up one dress, again, silk material. I think everything is kind of silky, airy material. So it's a long, I'd say kind of midi shirt dress with just a marble print on it. So I have got a belt to go with it as well because it's very long and kind of shapeless when it's on with a belt. So I'm taking a belt to kind of cinch it in. Oh, I'm just thinking, everything has got to be creased to fuck when I take it out of this case because I've rolled everything. Right, and then another night outfit is another two-piece. Love a two-piece. Just this green patterned shirt. It was called Argyle print on Shein, but it's just a little diamond with a flower in the middle. And then the bottoms are just the exact same long flared trousers. They come quite ankle length on me, actually. They're not actually that long on me, more ankle grazer length, but it's fine. I'll be wearing my dock sandals with everything. So I'm taking one pair of, I don't know actually, I might check that case, one pair of going out sandals, which are my dock sandals, and then a few pairs of like flippy flops. So I have got other clothes here. Um, I've got another day outfit. This I've already worn, orange and pink striped shirt and shorts. So three day outfits and three of them are shirt and short suits. Shirt and short, shirt and short, shirt and short sets. Fuck me. And then I'm thinking this for a night outfit. I've never had this on. This is also for Shein quite a while ago. Never had it on purely because this top, right? This top, a wee peplum crop top right and then you've got the rubbed bit at the top you would think that bit would sit over your boobs but it doesn't it sits like this so the peplum bit sits over your boobs so one gusty wind your ladies are out but i'm thinking taking this and then using like a bandeau bikini underneath so nothing gets shown these trousers are wide leg but they are more ankle grazer length so i'm going to take that i've never worn it before and i like to say so i'll take that and work it out. So that's another night outfit planned. And then I have this dress out. I don't know what I was planning for this dress. I just really like it. So I might just take that as like an additional day outfit if we need it. Strange I'm only taking one pair of shoes. No. Because I know if I take more I'll only end up wearing one anyway so there is no point. Right, that is my case as packed as it's going to be just now. Hmm, I need to do my toenails, I need to do my tan, that is all I have left to do. I was going to edit my B&M video but I've not got time, I'll just need to do that when I'm back. Time is 10.11. Still on track. I wanted everything done by 12. Still on track. The thought of doing my tan though. Oh my god. Okay, I'm going to paint my toenails a different colour actually. I was going to just keep them pink but I decided freshen them up, you know. So I'm using the Barry M Coconut Infusion Gel Nail Paint. This nice orange shade. Very holiday. 
full desk. So that's what's going on my toes. I'm going to do that right now. Again, not showing you the toes. People pay for that. Not on this channel. Mm -mm. Let's do my toes. Very bright. So I think I'm fully packed and fully prepped for my holiday to Benidorm. I feel like I'm forgetting Sahar. I've got Samantha there and she is more an overpacker than me. So it took a little bit of stress off this time, but it's still stressful. Packing anywhere is stressful, but it's Spain. If I need anything, I can go and buy it. So I hope you enjoyed this pack and pretty with me and I'll see you in Benidorm. Bye!